Hey, I'm Dora, and I'm going to introduce you to the ultimate lineup of what I think should be on, you know, what I would love to do. Uh, Dead or Alive, uh, Bathory, Venom, King Diamond, Cannibal Corpse, of course. Uh, I would have to say another one, uh, and Suffocation for sure, would be my band's uh, dream tour that I would like to be on. It's generally just music that I grew up with, man, that I have a really strong appreciation for. Uh, inspirational music for me. Uh, King Diamond is just, man, it's how it's so dark, you know, and how it's so, like, operatic in a sense, you know, in a metal way because of his vocals. It's really, I like bands that really step outside the box, you know, and just really sound originally as themselves. Uh, Bathory for their sound and their Viking, you know, Nordic, you know, Swedish, uh, you know, that really blew up most of the bands that I listen to today. As you can see, Wattane is one. Uh, so Bathory is one of them. Uh, Venom because I like the fucking rock and roll. You gotta have rock and roll, man. And black metal and rock and roll go good together. Good albums like that is Rain Chaos of Dissection. An ultimate album, I would say, also for that would be, uh, you know, one of the satir later Satyricon albums. They got a rock vibe to it, so they're, they're really good albums. Uh, and Cannibal Corpse, man, it's, I grew up with that shit, dude. It's legendary, man. I grew up with Tomb of the Mutilated, uh, Eaten Back to Life. Uh, I was 13 when I listened to Cannibal Corpse. It was one of the first extreme death metal bands that I've ever discovered in metal and metal.